Just a stone's throw from the busy Salford Quays lies a little gem, Audsall Hall. This place is old. It was first mentioned in 1177. The main central hall is from the 13th century and extensions were added in the 16th century. It was originally a moated Tudor mansion with two stables, three granges, an orchard, a windmill and 80 acres of farmland with six acres of meadow. From 1335 the house was owned by the Radcliffe family of Radcliffe Tower near Bury. It remained with them for the next 300 years. made a hole in my purse, I can tell you, but I need a building that fits my status. But don't forget, I'm High Sheriff of Lancashire and Steward of Salford. I represent the King. Yeah, but that's not so simple as it was. Now, we all thought the birth of Prince Edward might be a sign of peace to come, but the plan to marry him off to the young Queen of Scots has come to nothing, and I had to recruit 400 men so that King Henry can go and fight in Scotland. Well, at least I'll be fighting Scots, not good Catholic Englishmen this time. That is for now. Oh, it's, it's not the king I worry about. From what I hear, he's all for traditional worship. He's decided only those of general blood may read the Bible. And a good thing, too. What, and we should have Hodge the stable boy mangling the scriptures in the alehouse? Quiff. And I'll confess I've done as well as any other knight out of the dissolving of the monasteries. I, I bought some fine lands at Wally. But with Catherine Parr beside the king, the Protestant group at court is getting stronger. And I worry how much young Edward might listen to them. Well, that's tomorrow's troubles. Today I have to get these men of mine armed and provisioned, ready to take ship for Edinburgh. Take a look round the house. Alice will take care of you. I'll see you at supper. If I ever get through these papers. Bye.